All right, here's three <coughs> law questions. Um, in the first one, <coughs> they want you to know if you know how to use the product rule. They're basically just wanting you to break this up. So since there's a multiplication there, I can break it up into log base two of four plus log base two of eight. And that's the product rule. And they just say, <coughs> expresses some of logarithms. Um, but they, if they say to simplify, we should simplify that more because the log base two of four is two. You could do that on your calculator. Log base two of eight is three, and then two plus eight would be uh, five. Another way you could have done that one is you could have multiplied the, the uh, four times eight to give you 32. And then just done that on your calculator, it would have been 5. But really, this is what I was looking for to begin with, because that expresses it as a sum. There's the sum of two logs. Now, no, number 17 at the bottom there, it has log of 3 plus x minus log of x minus 3 is equal to log of 3. So this is an equation. And what I need to do is squish these two. Since there's a minus there, that's the quotient rule. So it'll be log of 3 plus x over x minus 3 uh, is equal to the log of 3. So once I've squished them, if I have a log on this side and this side, I can just drop those logs. So I'll have 3 plus x over x minus 3 <coughs> is equal to 3. Then I'll use the uh, um, clear fractions rule. So I'll multiply this side by an x minus 3 to get rid of it on the bottom. But if I multiply the left side, I have to also multiply the right side. So we'll have 3 plus x equals, and then I'll distribute that. So it'll be 3x minus 9. And then I'll get my x's together and my numbers. So subtract 9 on each side, or subtract x. So it'll be 2x minus 9 equals 3. <clears throat> and then add 9 to both sides. So 12 is equal to 2x. And then lastly, divide by 2. <clears throat> okay, and now number 18. Similar kind of game. So I'm wanting to squish these two logs. But this time there's a plus there, so let's multiply the product rule. So to squish, I'd have log base 4 of x minus 6 times x minus 6 was equal to 1. Now, I'd like to get rid of that log, but I, I can't divide each side by log. What I have to do now is change its form from log form to exponential form. Since my base here is 4, it'll be 4 to the first equals x minus 6 times x minus 6. Or 4 is equal to, if you fo foil this out, it'll be x squared minus 6x minus 6x plus 36. And then I see an x squared, so I'll make it equal to 0, subtracting 4 on each side. Minus 12x plus 32. And then I'll see if I can factor that. I think it comes out, out to x minus 8 and x minus 4. So then x minus 8 is equal to 4. Don't need that bracket. Or x minus 4 is equal to, what am I doing? x minus 8 equals 0. Or x minus 4 equals 0. Add 8 to both sides. Add 4 to both sides. Now, I need to check. I'm, gonna, I'm a little suspicious of, this, of that one. If I take and I plug that in there, 4 take away 6 is a negative 2. And log base 4 of a negative 2 is undefined. So this one won't work. But if I take that 8 and plug it in here, 8 take away 6 is positive 2. 8 take away 6 positive 2. I'm sure the 8's confident that the 8 will work. But I hope that helps you with those three questions.